And now, the question and answer session with our founder, our believer, our visionary, Mr. David Harrison. Well, thank you, Mr. Wade. You did a fantastic job again tonight. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Giovanni Wade. Excellent job. Well, I don't have too many questions tonight, but I'm sure you guys will be busy um, typing up a few questions for me while I get started here answering the questions that we do have. What I will do, though, is a few folks have let us know that they're uh, on the call tonight uh, from different parts of the world, so I'll do a shout out to Trinidad. Hi Trinidad, great to have you with us tonight. I look forward to seeing you guys doing great things and uh, you guys have got some good competition in the islands there. Some of the other groups are doing quite well too. Uh, I know we've got uh, Malaysia on the call tonight, so welcome Malaysia. Alright, so let's see what we got here. Uh, Harry's asking, will this session be recorded for later replay? Yes, it is recording tonight. Uh, I have a, a, well, the company has a Vimeo account, and I'll be posting it to Vimeo later tonight. All right, okay, Anthony's asking, what about the international debit card? Well, the international debit card is available. You can purchase it from your back office, and uh, uh, our first shipment of international cards have been shipped already. Um, I would expect everybody should anticipate that they will see those cards in the next week. Um, I've got more cards arriving uh, uh, sometime either later this week or early next week, which I'll be shipping out immediately to those who've placed orders in the order in which I received the orders. Okay, I've got a lot of cards coming, so everybody will be satisfied. Um, I'm going to get back to uh, Mark's question here. He was asking, uh, would like to know if there is a way to receive a 10,000 loadable and daily spend limit, 3,000 daily withdrawal limit on my US Platinum uh, Visa debit card. That's a great question. You can, well, keep in mind that the uh, the US Visa Platinum debit card is a demand deposit, uh, is attached to a de demand deposit account. Um, it's uh, basically, uh, the way we all look at it is when we go into the bank and open a check account, they usually want to issue you with a with a check card, uh, with a debit card, and that's exactly what this, this Direct Pay Express uh, Platinum debit card is. So, you can transfer out of that account uh, to your own bank account if, if the figures get very big or when the, fig <laughs> when the figures get very big, you can start transferring it out. Uh, you can, the, the fees on that card are extremely small, uh, very, very, very competitive and we're very excited about that as well as some philanthropic um, benefits on that card and some, um, some other cash back deals. So it's a great card to use for your everyday spending. It's very reliable. It's uh, it is a bank. So uh, the limits uh, um, it does have a ten thousand dollar limit, uh, a loadable limit on the card. Um, I think three thousand daily sounds right, Mark. Uh, it is something like that. Uh, of course, you'll have if you want to be spending more than that, then you would have to go up into a bank and and request that most likely. All right. So let's see what else have we got here. Are we going to have seminars around the world, asked Paul. Uh, that is a great question. I was just thinking this afternoon that we have to come up with some other call times. Um, we will organize that as we have presenters who are in a position to be able to uh, fit some different time slots. I know that the Australians are pretty keen to see us do a call at a different time. It's uh, it's kind of midday there, so I'm a bit later. So it's uh, on a weekday. It's not very practical for a lot of them. All right, let's see. So, Paul, yes, we will be doing that. And if we've got anybody who wants to put their hand up to help us do a presentation at uh, different uh, times of the day, I'm more than happy to support that effort. All right, let's see. What else have we got here? Uh, Larry, I'm not quite sure what – Larry's asking about advertising. I'm not quite sure what those two uh, advertising vehicles are, Larry, so sorry. I really can't help you out with that. Kenyatta, I hope I pronounced that correctly. If I didn't, I apologize, wants to know – uh, do we have to join Vimeo to access the recording? No, no, you don't. Um, in fact, I'll have the um, I'll put it in the um, uh, resources section of the back office too. You can you can uh, obviously uh, join up on our on our Vimeo page so that you get notifications when we post things there as well. Calvin's asking, what do you think about updating the websites to make it more user friendly? Uh, so a prospect can go in and watch a video that explains the four corners and sign up. That's a great question. Um, I actually was uh, reading over our um, uh, new copywriters material for, for a marketing video that we're putting together. Um, we're not going to put it on the website. He, here's what we're trying to do. We're trying to keep Four Corners Alliance Group with more of a corporate theme. 
and I know that that doesn't bode well with marketing. Uh, and I think that we need to keep a corporate presence about us, uh, professional presence. Um, and so it makes sense to have a separate website for our more of a marketing focus. And so that's the direction that we're taking. So you guys will be seeing the fruits of that here in the next couple of weeks. Uh, Bruce is asking, which card company is it? I'm not quite sure, Bruce, uh, what you're asking me there. All right, uh, Malaysia's asking, uh, when can we have a corporate video? Um, it's coming. And uh, if you guys need some assistance with some translations, uh, send in a support ticket. I'd like to help you guys uh, really get uh, uh, Malaysia on fire. All right, now, Athena's asking, do I receive the 100% match bonus after I complete the seventh levels first. No, you don't have to do that. You, Every person that you personally sponsor, whenever they make money, you make money. That's the way to look at that. And Mark's just giving me a little acknowledgement here. You're welcome, Mark, and I'll, I'll be following up with you tomorrow too, by the way. All right, let's see here. Joel's asking you actually a good question here. Uh, can a person have multiple positions uh, or take a new position? We discourage that. There's people who want to sign up an entity and so on and so forth, and there's obviously a strategic reason to do that. Um, the way that our compensation plan works, there's no strategy in, in what they call stacking in the industry. Uh, there's no advantage in having um, uh, family members that are never going to work the business sitting in certain places because you're really not leveraging uh, the compensation plan correctly. Uh, as you get to know, understand how the compensation plan works, you'll realize that there's no big advantage in that. And it makes a lot more sense to um, strategically use those positions. Um, a lot of the teams are doing pay it forward, so use pay it forward to place people in there that are going to get to work so you can start getting those matching bonuses. And I'm going to emphasize this, the magic in this compensation plan is the matching bonuses. That's where, uh, that's where the money really is to be made. Uh, let's see here. Okay, Mark's asking another question here, and I'm just running down the list, and I'll try and get them all. Let's not, I won't be here all night, though, so let me just move this along. Also, is there a way to spend uh, your available balance to sign up new members? You bet there is. One of the things with um, that we wanted to put together is we wanted to be make, make it possible so that uh, people could use, and we're talking about this pay it forward mechanism, people want to be able to bring other people in um, uh, pay it forward, do, a, do something philanthropic, help, help somebody else who wants to help themselves change their life, start making some money, make some extra cash, whatever the circumstances are. And you can do that in one of several ways. You can um, use that demand deposit account. Four Corners has an account over there too. That's how we pay everybody's withdrawal requests every week. So we extended that whole mechanism so that in your back office you can create a, a link uh, so that you can hand that link out to somebody and by default it's a one-time use link and they can go sign up, they don't have to use a credit card or anything and it will actually take the $18 from your bank account over at, over at the bank that's attached to the DPX card and it'll credit the Four Corners account and complete that purchase. Uh, you can also use that exact same concept with commissions. So. Uh, it's a very flexible system. There's a little bit to it, so I've got a video on that page, on the Pay It Forward page in your back office that explains how it works. Um, I've been asked repeatedly by my support team to improve that video. Um, I can get a little, uh, I guess, technical and, and dare I say waffle, so I'll try and uh, sharpen it up a bit for everybody so that it, it makes sense. And, and we've added extra features now too. Thanks, Mark. That was a good, good question and a memory jog for me there. Dennis is asking, if someone does no work, could they still fill their 4x6 matrix? You know what, Dennis, in theory you could. Um, I think it's, uh, you might as well go get a lottery ticket. I think that, you know, that's 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 where that falls into that kind of category. Um, somebody might make it that way and good luck to them, but it's I, I wouldn't be hanging my future on something like that, that's for sure. Uh, and like I said, the real power of this um, compensation plan is in the matches. And look, it's an $18 program. It's $18 because I wanted to be able to help people around the world, right? If we live in a more affluent society or we're, we've got a circle of friends that are more affluent, the products apply to everybody. So why not have them buy the first three products, the first four products? It's, it's not a problem for them. Some other folks, it is, it is a, a lot of money for them. Um, in some countries, $18 is a month's income. So that's the reason it's an $18 program. 
Um, it's uh, a good idea to study the compensation plan and work out how to leverage it to, to maximize the kind of expectations that your friends and circle of influence would expect uh, out of a home-based business. Let's see here. Pam's asking, are we able to have a personal membership in a personal company membership as well? I'm not quite sure what you're asking there, Pam. All right, I'll have to keep moving along here. Let's see. Okay, Anthony's asking a good question. I have a church group ready to sign. Can we use 1CC to sign up the team? No, you can't. Well, you can. Here's an important thing about credit cards. Your credit card belongs to your issuing bank, whoever that is, and they sure as heck don't want to see you running a credit card buying the same thing over and over again. That get gets them pretty freaked out. Uh, it gets us a little freaked out too because it's a risk. So we let everybody use a card maximum of five times. That's yourself and for four other people if you want to bring in and pay your first front row into the business. If you want to take it beyond that and work with a church group, and we've got a lot of church groups in the business doing this right now, that's exactly why we implemented the pay it forward mechanism. Um, Anthony, pop into the back office there, go to pay it forward and click on that video and take a look at how that works. Um, just to give you guys some ideas on how you can do it with uh, organizations, um, that's the power of being able to collect funds, um, put it directly into that bank account, like create a direct pay express, order a card, you'll get the bank account immediately. You'll see it in the pay it forward page. You'll see uh, uh, a routing number, and we're talking about American banking here, folks, so for you guys overseas, bear with me a minute. So you'll have a routing number and an account number, and um, that's available to you immediately. So you could um, send funds using the uh, ACH network. Um, it's cheaper than doing wires. Try not to do wires. Your bank will charge you up to $50 for a wire. ACH might cost you a couple of bucks, uh, depending on your bank's, you know, how they've got you set up there. So use the ACH mechanism to transfer funds. And I wanted to make sure you still had control of your funds. I didn't want people sending me thousands of dollars that really belongs to them and not to this company. It's a hassle from a tax point of view for me and my accountant and my staff. And we don't want to be responsible for your money. We want you to have the assurance or the confidence that, you know what, no matter what, if any of the church comes and wants to you know, check up or they want to do an audit or what have you, uh, the funds are in your control, in your bank account, and they're at the ready so that as soon as you set up that pay it forward mechanism, it starts making those payments and you can start signing people up. Okay. All right. Nick's saying, I'm super excited about this awesome company. It's a God's blessing and thank you for developing it. Well, you're, you're welcome, Nick. I uh, wish you all the best. I'm looking forward to seeing you on payouts. In fact, I just did payouts uh, last night. I do all of the U.S. Direct Pay Express payouts on Monday late afternoon to make the uh, most of the banks have a cutoff or they run their batch files around between 6 and 10 at night. So I try to make sure I beat that so that the settlements are there ready to go. I promise I'm going to pay everybody on Tuesday, so I want to make sure that they are paid on Tuesdays. And the international card is instantaneous, so I, I usually pay those on a Tuesday and I pay all the solid trust pay members on a Tuesday as well. And that all occurred today. And you know what? I saw some new names in there. That's just pretty fantastic. I just love seeing new names in there. It's that just gives me a thrill. And for those guys who, who uh, got a payout today, congratulations. Keep up the great work, and uh, uh, I look forward to seeing those those uh, payments getting bigger and bigger. All right, Ronald's asking me here. Ronald's asking, is the newsletter going to be automatically coming out of our commissions? It does come out of commissions. You have the option to have it not do that if you wish. Check out your back office. Um, there's a huge advantage in getting on the newsletter. Uh, for financial reasons, it does accelerate your earnings quite dramatically. Uh, we are going to be uh, adding a lot of value to that uh, monthly subscription as well. We've got good content coming out from our financial expert, Jim Yarbrough. Uh, we're going to be doing once a month calls. In fact, I think we're planning on, uh, I've got a tentative to uh, host a call pretty here pretty soon to, the, to everybody, the whole company, so that everyone can get a taste of of what we're going to be doing in those calls that are specifically for the newsletter subscribers. So the first call is going to be open to everyone and after the first call we're going to keep the format to those people who are subscribing. Another thing we're going to be implementing very shortly is that those who are not subscribing will not be earning commissions from the newsletter. Uh, they'll earn commissions from everything else but the newsletter subscribers 
that will be a separate thing. It's a separate compensation plan. And um, right now, a lot of members have been enjoying earning uh, quite good money off the newsletter. Um, shortly here, though, you'll have to be participating in that to enjoy that benefit. So that's uh, that's a, that's a great question, Ronald. Thank you. Let's see here. I'll do a couple more. Larry's asking. He's a good one. Larry's asking, can I advertise in major newspapers? You, you bet you can. Now, uh, some of the newspapers may have some restrictions on uh, home-based business these days because um, um, I, I think a lot of people in the past have said some pretty crazy uh, things that uh, have made the newspapers have to be a little bit more cautious. So it would probably be a good idea to um, ask them about their guidelines. And um, uh, once they give them to you, then you can put something together. If you want a little help, I, I sure wouldn't mind seeing those before anything hits a major newspaper. So how about you shoot in a copy to, to support at fourcornersalliancegroup.com. I'll take a quick look at them and uh, we'll help you get started there, Larry. All right, Ralph's saying, how do you forward info via the internet? I'm not quite sure what you're asking me there, uh, Ralph. It's a, um, I'm just not quite sure what you mean. All right, Keith's got a good question. What are some of the better methods for lead generation and traffic generation? I haven't been doing that for quite a few years now, so I'm, I'm not the guy to be answering that question. Uh, I think uh, get back to, to uh, with your team leader. Uh, if you're not quite sure who that is in your group, contact support and we'll help you um, find that out and get you in touch with them. Um, we always try to respect the, well, we, we're pretty strict about this actually, to uh, respect the genealogy. Um, if you and your sponsor feel that you could use some help with that, then we can start looking up line to get you some help in that regard because it's in their best interest to help you and they want to help you, frankly. All right, let's see. Clinton, great job thus far. Stop preaching on option of upgrading at least to level three. All right, well, everyone everyone has their own way of doing things, Clinton. If, if you're happy with $18, that's perfect. Michelle's asking, will there be an op option to transfer commissions from one account to another? No, there won't be. I'm trying to make sure that Four Corners Alliance Group does not get construed as a uh, any kind of money services business, which falls under the uh, Department of Treasury, um, a whole bunch of different rules. So we're going to stay away from doing that kind of stuff. And that's one of the reasons why uh, deposits, uh, like the church example we we're talking about before, get sent to the uh, uh, the bank account that's attached to Direct Pay Express. Uh, Michelle, thanks for the question. All right, let's see here. Elder's asking, uh, do we have someone in South Carolina to do a presentation? If you're asking about uh, live presentations, uh, I'm not aware of somebody who's doing live presentations in South Carolina. I did get a call from a young man last week uh, from um, San Diego who was asking me a similar question for his area. I think it would make a lot of sense for us to get something on our website in the back office that can help folks kind of plug into events that are going on. So we're, I'm going to be looking at getting something together in that regard in the back office there. Uh, Dennis, uh, I'm not going to answer, well I guess I could answer your, here's what Dennis is asking, I don't want everyone to think it's something I don't want to answer, it's just it, what happens if someone dies and it is a good question, it's somewhat morbid but of course it's a reality. Um, if someone dies then their beneficiary needs to contact support, um, provide some supporting evidence about the fact that they are the beneficiary and uh, we'll turn over the accounts to that beneficiary. That's really, you know, there's a little bit more to it, but that's really the, the essence of it. Uh, and it is a good question, Dennis, and I hope uh, uh, no one in your organization or family is uh, likely to be in that position anytime soon. Uh, Jules asking, is there a way we can get a copy of the PowerPoint presentation? I, I leave that up to the presenters. It's their property. I appreciate the fact that they uh, provide it for us here on, on the corporate webinars. Um, that's really up to each of them to decide whether they're willing to do that. So I'll leave that up to Mr. Wade. Uh, Joel's asking, can a person come in immediately at more than uh, level one um, or do we need to wait for someone to mark us as paid? Um, I'm looking at an option to have people come in at uh, a higher level right in the join process. It's a bit of a double-edged sword really because um, I like the marketing message to be clean. There's a lot to be said for keeping it that way. However, the more people, the, if, if you've got a, this is what I was leading to before, if you've got a group that really has a, the mindset of, of wanting to buy the books and get into the higher levels immediately, uh, I can certainly see the argument for doing that and, and so you could have a, a different sign up. So I'm looking at the different options we could do around that so that it's not confusing when someone comes in to see that there's different options and what have you 
and I'm just trying to work out the cleanest way to set that up so that the teams can can put their strategy together and just walk somebody, take them by the hand and walk them through a sign up that doesn't uh, give them reason to pause or think or ask questions. You guys got a lot of great questions. Jesse's asking, should we buy the card before there is money in your account? Um, I'll, I leave that up to, I don't, I'm not want to push people either way. Here's the advantage of doing that. The US card takes about, well, I was, I was always saying seven to 10 days, business days. Sometimes it takes a little bit longer. I can tell you it's shipped out of, um, out of Tennessee. So if you live in neighboring states around Tennessee, and I'll give you an ex I know that uh, the guys in, uh, in Florida are getting them in two days, right? Two business days. So uh, use that as a yardstick. If you live in California, it takes you longer. Obviously, if you live in uh, Alaska, it's going to take even longer, right, by, by mail. So I think um, that's, a, that's a good way to look at that. Uh, sorry, I lost my train of thought there reading, that, reading something else here. Um, I'm trying to zip through these as quickly as I can. So anyway, yeah, sorry, Jesse, the answer to the question is yes, you could um, get the card sooner and that way you've got it on its way so that when you've got permission to be paid, uh, it, you've got it in your hand and you're ready to go and there's no reason to be concerned that you won't get a card and won't be able to be paid. You could look at it that way and I think for the international people, there's even more, more reason to feel that way because there is a longer time to get those cards delivered internationally as well. Um, a few people have been asking about flyers, business cards and the like. I've got a designer that uh, is standing by. Um, we need to get together and start talking about some of these designs. I'll put the designs up in the back office so that you can go to a printer and get those guys popped out with your own names on there and so on. Um, Sandra is asking, do we do business in Nigeria? Yes, we do. We've got a few people starting up uh, activities in Nigeria at the moment. All right. Well, it, a lot, there's a lot of other great questions. I think that uh, we're going to have to wrap it up here. It's 10.47. Uh, I want to thank, uh, in the east coast of the USA, I want to thank everybody for their time tonight. Uh, we really appreciate you taking uh, time out of your busy schedule to be with us. We're excited to be able to present you this opportunity. Um, I'm excited to be able to present the products that I think can really make an impact on everybody's lives. Um, product, uh, those products one and two books are fantastic starting points. If you just take that product to Millionaire Mindset and read something, whether it's just while you're having breakfast in the morning before you have to run off to work, read something every morning for 90 days and that alone will change your life. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is David Harrison. I'm the CEO of Four Corners Alliance Group. Thank you for being with us and have a wonderful night or wonderful day. Bye for now.